Negative. Negative. Yes. I don't need pushback. Yes, okay, okay. Just approve. X-ray alpha Oscar zero. X-ray alpha Oscar zero Victor. Approved. Expect runway two two. Hello everybody, welcome to Chaz Dracot Media and welcome to another episode of Tower Simulator 3. Today you join me for a little bit of a quick stint, it's only going to be about half an hour or so, but yet again we're going back through the airports that I've not played in a while because the guys are working on the latest update to the game which is going to be update 4. I'm doing a bit of content with them on that and I'm really excited to obviously show you guys what it's going to be like. The new update is fantastic, it looks so pretty as well. There's some lovely features that are coming in as well that will really help the gameplay so I'm looking forward to seeing what you all think of that and obviously I'll be playing it as well when the time comes. Today we're going to Puerto Vallarta in Mexico. We're going to this small but busy airport to have a good time basically. I'm using my own database for this. Clear weather, we're going to go 7am. We should have about 50 departures in an hour here so we should have a good number of them in a little half hour stint that we're going to jump in on using the Energist Design aircraft and of course standard uh, radars. <clears throat> right, a few things to get out of the way first. It's very bright out there at the minute. I've got to leave that back door open. I've got to leave that door open for the kitchen. I'm looking after my mum's dog, Bosco, at the minute. He's a gorgeous boy. Look at him. Absolutely beautiful creature. But he may be wandering about behind me and all sorts. Um, he's, to be fair, he's lay over there at the moment, just chin-chilling. But, yeah, I've got all doors and all sorts open. And it is boiling, so... Yeah, I'm kind of glad to have that open anyway. Still, we're not going to pick a runway here. We're just going to jump straight into the game and enjoy a stint at Puerto Vallarta. Okay, straight into the tower. And as you can see quite sort of sunrise-ish conditions here this morning. There's already aircraft ready to push back. There's a United 737 getting ready to go and it's a very simple layout here at Puerto Vallarta so we'll keep our eyes on everything from in here. Uh, what runway are we going to use today? We're going to use runway 22 so we go over to the F4 screen, get everything set up there. The strips are nice and simple here at this airport as well. Yeah, really pleased. Ready to go and I'm just going to take a quick check. So the F7 the camera ground. goes up Sun above the tower, which is with a really, really good place to go. Push and start. Because, yeah, you get a decent view, actually, from up here. I might just use this one. I don't think I'm going to use the, the F8 cameras down there. F9 is down on the departure, so, yeah, all is good. We'll, we'll use the F7 camera to have a look around. I've got Sunwing asking for pushback. Is that one of them? Flare? There's a few Flare flights ready to go. There's Viva as well. They've just had the tug come back up to their aircraft. Uh, Sunwing 8747 is on the end of that pier, so it's there. Yeah. Okay. Delta. Cool. Requesting push and start. Sunwing 8747 push back approved. Expect runway 22. Flare 750 push back approved. Expect runway 22. I feel there's going to be a number of flare departures push all at once here. We've got Sunwing coming Sunwing in as well. Let's go push up to F7 and then flare. flare there's a Westjet 737. There's an Alaskan Embraer as well. Cool. Hey, we'll have a little flight around actually. Just have a quick ganders at some aircraft. It's all 737s except for that Embraer on this side. That's a 737-900. A few Sunwings down here. Oh, look at that. Different livery on that one. The Planet Hollywood livery. That's cool. That's the standard Sunwing livery. There's a 737-800 and a 737-MAX. There's three of them wanting to go out. And United wanting to push as well. Is everyone wanting pushback? Just not WestJet or them. These lot aren't, actually. These A320s. That's an A321neo, actually. Uh, there's a few of these wanting pushback, i.e. one at the moment. That's also flare. There's the old flare livery as well next to it. I really like that. With the little blob nose on it. That's cool. That's the little thing that's over here. That thing there. Which for some reason has got a tug attached to it. Sunwing 49090. Pushback approved. Expect runway 22. X-Ray Alpha Echo Papa Charlie. Pushback approved. Expect runway 22. We can get them on at the likes of Golf or even Pushback Echo. Approved. Expect runway 22. Sunwing 49090. He's going to say negative. Negative. I don't need pushback truck. Just approve. Well, you've Echo got Papa a tug Charlie. pushed onto the front of your aircraft so you can see where I'm coming from. X-Ray Alpha Echo Papa Charlie approved. Expect runway 22. Fine, you picky sod. Approved. United wants two. pushback as well. Now that's Charlie. United on the end there. The I've told Sunwing the other two to push back, so I'm going to tell them to wait. Taxi. United 3636, standby. Flare 750, runway 22 via Alpha. No. Standby. United Golf. Is it Golf? Runway two Golf. Two via Alpha. Flare Sun 750. Flare 750, runway 22 via Golf. 
Nice cheddar. Good. Okay, United on the end wants pushback back as well. So we're going to have to tell them to wait. Um, mm. Are you now? Okay. Are you already? Yeah, but you're not though. You've told me you are, but you're still messing about. Yep. United 4303, stand by. Okay, so the other Sunwing is pushed back in front of that one, so we can tell those two to go together. See, now you've said you're ready to taxi. Flare's on its way out. That other flare is not called up yet. Actually, there they are. I thought I was going to be it when I got cocky. Flare 5262, pushback approved. Expect runway 22. X-ray Alpha Echo Papa Charlie, runway 22 at Echo via Alpha. Look at that. So they can go straight across there. Okay, we've got aircraft on arrival. Sunwing and Alaskan 2222. <laughs> Sunwing 49090, runway 22 via Golf. Sunwing 8747, follow company. See if they follow. So they're going to get moving. Are they going to follow them? Follow company. Sunwing 8747. I wonder if it has to be the same airline. Sunwing 4990, ready to taxi. No, it doesn't look like they're going to follow him. Sunwing 8747, runway 22 via Golf. Viva Air... F yeah. Viva Air 79024, pushback approved, expect runway 22. United 4303, pushback approved, expect runway 22. Cool. So we've got some more aircraft on that side wanting to push back. Uh, we'll get them pushing back once this pesky sausage has gone past them. Because that one wants to push, that one wants to push. They've got a beacon light on as well. Goodness me. Right, let's get our arrival in. Sunwing 6225, runway 22 clear to land. There's a lot of two twos at the moment, isn't there? Let's get all these. United and Sunwing are the ones that want pushback. And another one just came up. Delta, flipping it. That's Delta over there. Right, okay. Uh, okay. X-ray Alpha, Echo, Papa, Charlie, runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff. Upon reaching altitude, 1,000 contact departure. Let's get them out of here. Runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff. On reaching altitude, get on with it. Contact departure. It's a shorter run for them, so. May as well get them cracking on. Whoa, that's a hefty pushback. We've got a few aircraft taxiing down there. That's not one of ours. They're pushing back. Airbus A320. Push push cool. Okay, so we're going to get a bunch of departures out here all at once. Flare 5262, runway 22 via Alpha. Sunwing 3540, pushback approved. Expect runway 22. United 3636, pushback approved. Expect runway 22. Delta 3137, standby. Good stuff. There's X-ray Alpha, Echo Fly Papa Alpha. Charlie. They're now out of here. Push back approved. Expect runway Got an arrival coming in. This is the situation down at the Push far end. So Flare is queued up with Sunwing. There's another one coming out as well. And then we've got an aircraft on arrival as well. A few more planes taxiing out, but not many of them. Good. Wow. United 4303, runway 22 via Golf. Viab uh, 7924, runway 22 via Golf. Luxjet 6963, pushback approved. Expect runway 22. Runway 22 via Golf. Come on. United 4303. Runway 22 via Golf. Mm. Viab 7924. He hasn't. Oh, it's Flexjet. I don't need pushback truck. But you've. But you've got a pushback tug and you're in a Learjet. Ah, come on. Flexjet 6963, pushback approved, expect runway 22. I did it again. Flexjet 6963, approved, expect runway 22. Should have Sunwing arriving now. Here they are. Big queue of 737s to go. And we've got one coming in. Is that all orange? Or am I just being blind? That's yeah, just some wing flying orange. It's like an American easy jet, isn't it? 
zero ready to right, can we get you out of here? And have we got separation? Flare 75 is zero. Runway 22, line up and wait. Okay. Runway 22, line up and two wait. aircraft pushing Flare back. JetBlue 2362, stand by. Stand by. We've got Flare two lining three, up. Six, two. Valor and ground. Flux Jet 69 or 63 ready to taxi. They better hurry up. Oh, Sunwing needs to get off there. They will. Flare 750, runway 22 cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Get out of here. Runway two and two then we'll clear, clear for Alaskan for landing. They're going to come in slowly. Contact departure. Flare 750. Delta. Is it that one? No. United 3636, runway 22 via Gulf. Sunwing 3540, runway 22 via Gulf. Flare 7783, pushback approved, expect runway 22. Alaskan 2222, runway 22 clear to land. That was more of a mouthful than I expected. That's what she said. United 3636. Is it? Runway 22 via Flexjet 6963, runway 22 Echo via Alpha. Sunwing 6225. Taxi to ramp via Alpha Echo. Good. Air park down there. There goes Flare taking off. In the background. And then any moment now, we should have an arrival, which is another 73. We're then going to get Valaris in, and then after Valaris, we're going to get an aircraft moving. Because they're going to go really slowly. X ray Bravo, Foxtrot, Bravo, Mike. So if we go down here, wait for this arrival, we're then going to tell Sunwing to line up behind next landing aircraft. I hope those words came out, I was being spoken over. Alaskan is a 737. Tasty. Right, let's get them cleared, shall we? Sunwing 4909 is zero. Runway 22, line up and wait behind next landing aircraft. Sunwing 4909 is zero, runway 22, line up behind next landing aircraft. Don't do it now. Runway 22, line up behind That's next it. landing wait. aircraft. Sunwing 4909 is zero. You wait. Cool. Okay, so now Alaskan's going to vacate. We can clear them. Valaris 5269 are runway 22, clear to land. Ready to start. I said this is going to be a chill stint. It's runway definitely not. 22. Right, so, oh, I've got a really itchy nose, man. It's very warm today. Flare 7783, runway 22 via Golf. Delta 3137, pushback approved, expect runway 22. JetBlue 2362, pushback approved, expect runway 22. Ah. Sunwing 6225, hold position. Alaskan 2222, taxi to ramp via Alpha Echo. Can we have another arrival? Yes, in just a sec. Look at the queue down here. Wow. Big, big queue of planes. That's crazy, isn't it? Okay. So over here, there's nothing going on. Got the private jet, flex jets ready to go there. They're halfway down the runway. They're holding. They're starting to taxi down there. These two are pushing back. Although we gave Delta clearance first, but they haven't done it before JetBlue, which is kind of good. They should push back in unison. But JetBlue have done it first, basically. That's fine. What? Flare 7783, runway 22 via Alpha. I said Golf, didn't I? Okay, so they've landed. Valaris has landed in their Airbus A320. Flexjet 6963, runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. So we're going to get them out of here. They're going to turn onto the runway and crack on, because they're going to get off here at this one. And then Sunwing is lined up. There's an aircraft on approach, but they're a long way away. See, look, they're doing 91 knots. I knew they would be going a lot slower. That's really, really good. It's good news. So, look, they're lined up and ready to go. But the aircraft that's on the approach is going so slowly. Flexjet now gets onto the runway just as the other one turns off and they can crack on. Polaris 5269er, taxi to ramp via Alpha Echo. 
Come on, Flex Jet. Taxi to ramp via Alpha. Get on with it. Echo. Okay, so Flex Jet's been given clearance. Nine. They've jumped Contra. a right queue there. Ready for taxi. Uh, we're not going to clear X-Ray Bravo just yet. JetBlue 2362, runway 22 via Golf. Delta 3137 is runway not pushing back, is it? Golf. JetBlue 2362. Strange. Strange behaviour. Mm, I don't even know if we can, like, get them to hold position or anything. There goes FlexJet. Sunwing 49090, runway 22 cleared for takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Get on with it. There they go. So we've got ages of time. Ages of time. Loads of time. There goes the 7-3. Okay. Delta, requesting push and start. Oh, God. Alaskan 3136, pushback approved. Expect runway 22. Right, now Delta's pushing back, push you back see. Approved. Expect runway 22. Oh, so annoying. Sunwing 6225, continue taxi. They're going there, they're going there, taxi. they're going there. Okay. We'll get Valaris to hold position, just in case. Valaris 5269, a hold position. Polaris 193, pushback approved, expect runway 22. We could get another one out. Sunwing 8747, runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Get on with it, and you will get out of there. I'm telling you. Oh. They will get out of there, I'm telling you. On reaching altitude 1000. Right, Contact so how far departure. back is Delta Sunwing pushing? Not far enough for them to go past them. You can't see them actually, they're down in the bottom of the screen, just behind my head here. Sunwing's on its way in. But Delta should be good to taxi any second now, and Sunwing will not be stupid and they will wait for them, won't you? You're not just going to drive into the side of them. Please. Alert ground. VR app of 3014 with information Delta requesting push and Please, start. Please, Sunwing, I'm waiting. Alarty ground. Delta 3137 Stop. ready for taxi. Thank you. Christ. Delta 3137, runway 22 via Golf. X-ray Bravo, Foxtrot Bravo, Mike, runway 22 clear to land. Sun Country 4675, go around. Sun Country 4675, contact departure. Let's get them out of here. Because they were closing in on them. Look how much they were catching them. So. Right. Flare 5262, runway 22, line up behind next landing aircraft. Alaskan 3136, runway 22 via Alpha. We need this one to be ready. We need Volaris to be ready to taxi because they're coming in there. There it is. Volaris 193, runway 22 via Golf. What's our arrival? Shed. Look at the shed. So when they go past, Flair will start lining up. Look at that. <laughs> oh man. We've got a huge, huge queue of aircraft. Volaris is holding position. These are taxiing out, they're taxiing in, they're taxiing out, this one's pushed back, this one's pushed back, but they are coming in here. Right. Polaris 5269er, continue taxi. Polaris 7354, pushback approved, expect runway 22. We'll just push them back in front of them. Come on, get out of there. They're going to turn off at the next point here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Flare 5262, runway 22, clear to immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. You better hurry up. Runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff on reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Oh my god, they're rolling Flare already. Flipping out, that was ropey. United 4303, runway 22, cleared for takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. So obviously I've not said immediate departure runway there. 22. Or immediate takeoff, I should say, because that then means that they'll get to the runway and then stop for a minute before then getting rolling. Okay, there's a humongous queue of aircraft down here. Look at this. I think we've got, what, nine? Yeah, nine aircraft in queue, with one on the roll as well on takeoff. 
Let's get X-Ray Bravo in. X-Ray Bravo, Foxtrot Bravo. Mike, taxi to ramp via Echo. Taxi to ramp via Echo. X-Ray Bravo, Foxtrot Bravo, Mike. Yep, Sun Country is gone. We've got nobody coming in for ages yet. United 4303 is just getting rolling. Velata ground. Flex jet 2536. Information Delta. Ready to start. Flex jet 2536. Approved. Expect runway 22. I think that might cause us an issue there, you know. Volaris has not pushed back in front of the other aircraft, which is good to see. Viab seven nine two four runway two two cleared for takeoff upon reaching altitude one thousand contact departure. Viab three zero one four pushback approved, expect runway two two. This is going well. Another aircraft has just popped up. Extra Alpha, Oscar Oscar Victor. Oscar Zero Victor is on. You're noisy, aren't you? So what are these going to do down here, then? Are they... They're just going to push the tug out of the way? Amazing. Yeah, you are. You're really not. <laughs> but the little one that's just come in is going to park there. So hopefully Flexjet doesn't cause them any issues. The Abva is going to take off now. Oscar Zero Victor. That's really harsh, putting Oscar and Zero next to each other. What are you going to do? I'm intrigued by this. I think they're just going to turn right there, hopefully. And not cause Flexjet any issues. Please. Just turn right. Just turn right. Please just turn right. Turn sharp right now. Don't get in their way. You cretin. We literally... Get stuffed. No one liked you anyway. Flexjet 2536 ready to taxi. Flexjet 2536 runway 22 at Echo via Delta 1. Volaris 7354 runway 22 via Golf. Flexjet 2536. United 3636 runway 22 clear for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000 contact departure. Sunwing 3540, runway 22, line up and wait. Smashing. Runway 22. Smashing. Uh, we've got, what's LCT coming in? Tar. What's Tar? X-Ray Alpha, Oscar Zero, Victor, pushback approved, expect runway 22? Question mark? The Abva 3014, runway 22, via Golf. Negative. Negative. Yes. I don't need pushback. Yes, okay, okay. Just approve. X ray alpha Oscar Zero. X ray alpha Oscar Zero Victor. Approved. Expect runway 22. Got a departure going on. United on its way out. Someone lining up behind them. CFM powered Airbus A320 making its way. This sort of influx of departures is going to cause a little bit of 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 a little so Sunwing is lined up, ready to depart there, the next one that's going to come out. Uh, we need to just check that no one's on now. We've got Tar miles away. These lot are close to us down here. And uh, we've also got that one going that the way. Wow. Alpha, Oscar Zero, Victor, ready to taxi. Let's get Flexjet out. Flexjet 2536, runway 22, clear to immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. So they'll runway put strobe two, lights on. Cleared for immediate takeoff. And all their takeoff lights on, they will not slow down. They will turn onto the runway and they'll get straight on with it. We've got the 737 waiting at the end, but they don't need to worry so much about them. They're going to power it up and crack on. So every departure that we could possibly get out so far has been dealt with. Flexjet's been given clearance. Sun Country is not background yet, so we can put them okay. I was going to say under the others, but fine. Sunwing, no. <laughs> I just realised, I've just cleared Flexjet. X-Ray Alpha, Oscar Zero Victor, runway 22 at Echo via Delta 1. Good. Uh, let's wait for Sunwing, shall we? I love that flare livery, that's so cool. Looks retro. The CFMs are growling on the 7-3, they're ready to go. Flexjet's out of here. I think. There's rotation. Hops up off the ground. Look at the little Cessna. Oh, it's behind my head. There's a little Cessna down here. I think so, anyway. Is it a citation? Looks like a Cessna citation. 
tiny thing. Sunwing 3540, runway 22 cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. And they've got 10 miles till tar. Flare 7783, runway 22 cleared for takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. But it's still hard to do that with being spoken over. Okay. What is tar? Is it a 145, did it say? Yeah, it's an Embraer 145 coming in, so they won't be coming in too hot. Sunwing getting rolling. Takeoff. God, that citation's loud, isn't it? 737-800, this one. Juddering its way down the runway. Surprised those CFMs can get it moving. Oh, you know. That's Sunwing on final. Okay. So. Flare is also going to get moving. They're just starting their takeoff roll now, so that's some decent separation. We've got Tar. JetBlue 2362, runway 22, line up and wait. We'll get them on. Why not? And then we'll clear Tar 4316. So JetBlue is now going to line up on the runway. We'll get through this queue of traffic before we go anywhere. It's 27 minutes I've been recording now. Oh, sounded like... Yeah, sounds like extra alpha had to really slam on the anchors there. There goes Flare. Cracking on. And we will now check down it. It's quiet, isn't it? It's all of a sudden gone quiet. We've got an arrival coming in. The 145, so we can't really muck about with JetBlue. JetBlue 2362, runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff. Upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Get on it. Runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff. Okay. Upon reaching altitude 1000. Departure. We're going to clear tar. Tar 4316, runway 22, clear to land. Looking forward to seeing what tar is. I can't remember. Okay. Uh, what sort of gap have we got? Not really a lot to Sunwing. Then we've got Sun Country. We can't really send them around again, can we? So we will work on getting up to whoever that is. Viabva 3014 out of the airport. There goes JetBlue in their Airbus. A tree 20 and the horrendous glare on the window. Someone needs to clean these windows, to be honest with you. Has Bosco walked past? Not seen him. I can normally see him out the corner of my eye. Yes. Tar is on its way in, then Sunwing. Uh, yeah, we're not going to get anybody else out in the meantime. This is just going to be a bit of a waiting game now, everyone. We've got Delta, then Alaska, then Volaris, then more Volaris. There's a difference between an A320 Neo and an A321 Neo. And then we have the A321. Again, you can see the length difference in the two aircraft. A321 is a big old wagon. Sort of made to replace the Boeing 757 or to compete with it for a long time. And is now, as a, obviously the Neo version, a much superior aircraft, unfortunately. But still more love for a 757, I think, than an Airbus A321. I think that's safe to say. I do like this airport, you know. It's really cool. I like this little sort of area of all the biz jets and the GA and stuff down here. There's a few, actually, that are in little hangars back there, which I quite enjoy. Uh, in terms of what's actually at the terminal, we've got next to nothing, really. We've got a Volaris A321 that came in earlier on. The Alaskan Embraer, this thing's tiny. Oh, excuse me. That should be going out at some point. They've got nav and logo lights on, but no uh, beacon lights or anything. This came in earlier on. That came in earlier. And here is Tar. What are you? Oh, it literally says Tar on the side of it. Never seen that airline before. Okay, uh, we've got an aircraft coming in after them. Sunwing 1513, runway 22, clear to land. Runway Give them the clearance. Clear to land. Sunwing and then Sun Country's in after that, so we've got to wait. Uh, watch this. X-ray Alpha, Oscar Zero Victor, runway 22, clear for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. The 145 has stopped quickly. TAR 4316, taxi to ramp via Alpha Echo. Get in. Runway 22. Cleared in. for immediate takeoff on reaching altitude 1000. So they Contact can crack departure. on. X-ray Alpha Oscar Zero Victor. Taxi to ram. They can turn Alpha. on and just get on with Echo. it really, really quickly. So we may as well get rid of them while we can. Tower, Sunwing American is on its way in, but still. On final two two. Yeah, they're a while out yet. Yeah. American now coming in after Sun Country. 
flipping out. I'm not sure how quickly I'm going to be able to get these out. I might have to tell America to go around here just so we can get these departures out. Got a really itchy leg. Not that you asked. Sunwing 1513. Come on. Today. There goes Oscar Zero Victor. Making their way out. And here's the TAR 145. Really strange, that is. Very basic looking airline. But I'd never seen one of them before. Careful of the understeer sun. They're coming into one of these gates just down on our right hand side. Uh, yeah, Sunwing is next. 737. And then it's Sun Country, and I'd feel bad if we told them to go around again, so we're going to make sure they come in. There's Sunwing, it's a Boeing 737 MAX 8. I reckon we can get aircraft between these, you know. Delta 3137, runway 22, line up and wait. Runway 22. Let's get them in. Come on. Delta three, one, three, Come on. Seven. Come on. Come on. Get on with it, Delta. You probably weren't expecting that, but get on with it. I want to test myself to see whether five mile separation at an airport like this is still enough to get an aircraft in between. You can just see the lights there, actually. That's close. That's close. Delta 3137. Runway 22. Cleared for immediate takeoff. Upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. They're just getting off the runway, runway now. And they're being told now, go. There's the arriving aircraft on the right of the screen. Cool. And then we'll clear them. Sun Country 4675, runway 22, clear to land. So we can do it. We can do it. So, let's do this. Alaskan 3136, runway 22, line up behind next landing aircraft. So as soon as that aircraft's done, at the Line earliest potential convenience, they Alaska will get onto the runway. Sunwing 1513, taxi to ramp via Alpha Echo. And there goes Delta. Taxi to ramp there's 737, I believe that's a 900. And then in comes Sun Country. Great timing, decent separation that actually. Good, 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 very happy. Another TAR coming in and then another United coming in. What aircraft are we dealing with? It's just small stuff in it. 737-800. Yeah, 145, then another 737. Okay. So what's Alaskan going to do for us? Anything decent? Sun Country livery is quite nice. I'm looking forward to seeing this again. It's always got this sort of orange and purple about it. It's quite a tasty looking livery. Always reminds me of being quite a European livery. So look, as soon as they've gone past now, as soon as they've touched down, look, Alaskan's rolling. Don't you beep at me. Alaskan is getting going ASAP. Come on, let's make this work. I'm really hoping we make this work. Because the last one was even even harder because I had to manually move all of it. For this one, I reckon we're alright. Has Sun Country gone past? No, they've got it sorted. As soon as the little banner comes up at the bottom, I'll start the command. There we go. Alaskan 3136, runway 22, clear for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Runway 22. For immediate tuk -ef. Tuk -ef. We've got a tuk -ef near the end of the episode. Alaska well, have we got three more to go out? Yeah, three more. Okay, then we're going to clear them. American 5539er, runway 22 clear to land. And then we repeat the cycle. Valaris 19er 3, runway 22, line up behind next landing aircraft. Yeah, you get me? You with me, bro? Runway 22, cleared to land. American 5539er. Sun Country 4675, taxi to ramp via Alpha Echo. And Runway there goes our departure for Alaska. Next landing aircraft, Polaris 193, taxi to ramp cool. via Alpha. Once Echo. you get into a bit of a flow Sun with this Country airport, once you get that sort of initial influx of departures out of the way, it's really, really good. So Valaris is going to hold and wait there Valor until well. this aircraft comes Scarless in. And then, to be honest, there's a bit more Delta. of a gap Requesting between the next start. two. So after this... And once they've got on with it, we can probably tell another aircraft to go for immediate takeoff. Sky West wants to get going. Are you going in there? Yes, you are. So Sky West, you will have to wait, I'm afraid, in your little umbrella. Sky West 755, stand by. Please. Stand by. Where's our Sky arrival? West 755. Here it is. Valor to tower. United 7630 so, on final 2 Valaris in there, A321neo, will roll as soon as this 737 comes past. There's American in. Three, two, one, move. Beautiful. 
Absolutely beautiful. Okay. Wait for them to get down here near this taxiway, and then Valaris will be given instructions. And then we're going to get the other Valaris behind them to get moving as well, because they've got a little bit of time before Tar comes into the airfield. And ready. American should give us the little banner at the bottom any time now. Valaris 193, runway 22, cleared for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Valaris 7354, runway 22, line up and wait. Oh, sorry. American 5539er. Taxi to ramp via Alpha Echo. TAR 3330, pushback approved. Expect runway 22. Hang on, is that the 145 that... Yeah, they literally just came in. Wow. That's a very fast turnaround, isn't it? What? I suppose I've packed the schedule with more departures and landings than it could realistically handle, so... Echo. Makes sense. American five, five, There's three, Valaris 193 in their A321 Neo there two, now two. on their way out. Three, 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 zero. Company is now lined up in their A320. I think that's a Neo. Uh, yes, it is. We'll get them going. Valaris 7354, runway 22, clear for takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. And now they're out of here, we can clear runway Tar two, and United are both coming in. On reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Tar 875, runway 22, clear to land. We're going to get United to go around. United 7630, go around. United 7630, contact departure. Get you to go around. Runway 22, clear to land. Tar 875. Skywest 755, pushback approved. Expect runway 22. Go around. Viab 3014, runway 22, line up behind next landing aircraft. Crack in. Valority departure on 119.0. It United is. United 7630. Sorry, United. Good morning. Good morning. Good Have fun. Runway 22. Skywest 755. There goes Valaris. Runway 22, line up Making behind next landing out. aircraft. Viab 3014. Viab is next up. We've got this departure arrival, excuse me, coming in. Don't you beep. That's just a normal ground, Airbus A321, even though they've painted the visor on the front of it. It's got the smaller engines and no winglets. This is the... it's another TAR 145, I think. The second of them that we've had come in today. The other one is ready to taxi, as we've just heard. Here they go. So again, as soon as they touch down about here... Go on, here, here, here. Touch down there. Go on, just there, just there, just there. Just that, yeah, Neo, I don't know, how right did I get that? You lot could be the judge of that. The advert, ready to go. A bit of shenanigans going on down here. TAR 3330, runway 22 two via Golf. They're going to get off at Delta, aren't they? Going to get off at Delta? They are, nice. TAR 875, taxi to ramp via Alpha. Viab 3014, runway 22, clear for immediate takeoff upon reaching altitude 1000, contact departure. Bang in. Taxi to ramp. Via alpha. Get it rolling, son. Tar Use what you've got in them engines. For Power it up. Crack on. Beautiful. Okay. That's going to be everybody. Another little stint here at Puerto Vallarta. I really like this airport. Great challenge, but great fun. Really, really solid airport, this one. Hope you've enjoyed the episode. Thank you very much for watching, as always. We'll still make our way through more of these. Uh, I will hit 4,000 subscribers soon, as of the time of recording this video. So I will be doing a sort of joint 4,000 subs thing, as well as maybe doing my 100th episode of Tower Simulator 3, because it's, you know, the majority of the views on the channel come from this fantastic game. So I'm going to try and maybe do two different things to that, may roll it into one. We'll have to see. But that's all for now. Thanks very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Thank you.